Good morning, Osaka. Ooh, that's bright. That's bright. Uh, good morning, Osaka. Uh, first day here. Honestly, no idea what to do. Not one clue. It's nice though. I got like a, I got a cool view. Yeah. Uh, there's like the harbor and stuff over there. Looks nice. Yeah. Um. So, I don't know what to do with day one. I'm thinking maybe I go to the aquarium. Um. I hear like Dotonburi is good, but I feel like that's a thing that I should do at night. Um, obviously never being here, I wouldn't know. Uh, so yeah, how about we go eat breakfast? I made this plate look as disgusting as possible. I obviously suck at plating for buffets because this looks horrible. Notice the marbling on bacon is a little different in Japan. Like, it seems less fatty. The music on that bus was like, I was playing Wii Sports Resort. I don't know where I am. At all. Like, Osaka Station, I think. There are so many of these UFO kind of games for like food and stuff. Alright, Osaka day two. Day two? Day three? Today, I'm actually gonna go to the aquarium, I think. I didn't go yesterday. I didn't really, I went to uh, Dotonbury yesterday and did all that stuff, but I was really wasn't feeling that up for a whole lot of stuff. Got a lot of food, food stuff, but I didn't actually do a lot of vlogging. Just because I'm also my, my battery died on my camera really early, so today I have my handy portable charger, so it's gonna be going all day. You're gonna see so much of me today. <laughs> and then after that, I'm gonna go back to Namba and uh, do the eating in the evening, you know? Get all my eats done. So let's get to it. It is a windy day. Stupid idea to touch a stingray. I got jet black ice cream. Let's, um, let's try it out. Got on my lip. It's vanilla. It tastes like regular vanilla, but it's just black. That nice old woman tempted me with her okinamiyaki, and it was delicious. But I feel like she caught me into it. I'm so full now. Oh. Okay, I'm out of my food coma. I'm gonna go back out. 
I went to the sauna. I found out there's a sauna in this hotel too, and a steam room and stuff, so of course I had to do it. Um, so yeah, now I'm gonna go back to Dotonbon. Now I'm gonna go back to Dopeonbury. Dope Dopeonbury, no. And Namba. And yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna see where that goes. I'm gonna try to find some kombucha tea and that should help me digest while I'm doing this. I don't think you can find it as easily as you can in Vancouver though. <laughs> You should definitely get that guy's sushi in Canada. That was bomb. If I lived in Osaka, I'd be so fat. It'd be insane. Like, there's like good food everywhere. So I've had tempura, I've had karage, I've had. I went to a bar. I never take photos of bars here. They're very odd about it. Um, now I need to try to figure out what I want next. I've had takoyaki already, but I feel like I should try it again. I'm not the biggest fan of takoyaki. I don't know, it just doesn't do it for me. Um, but I'm always willing to give it another chance. All right, guys, it's my last day in Japan. Um, well, I mean, I'm leaving in a few hours now. Um, Sad to go. It's, it was a really cool experience and I'm definitely going to come back soon. So now yeah, and I'm just packing it up. Um, and then I'm going to catch a bus to uh, Kansai Airport and uh, Tokyo. Then uh, over to LA for a week. So that should be fun.